Hey everyone and welcome back to another Jazzy Wicks candle review. Today I am reviewing Yankee Candles Witches Brew for you. Um, unfortunately, this is the only Halloween scent we are getting here in the UK this year, which is really sad. Um, the US are getting a few others as well. I'll go through that in a little bit. But this is the only one we're getting here in the UK. We don't sadly get any pumpkin scents or anything. Just the autumn collection, which I've already reviewed. And just the four cents from that. And then Witch's Brew. So this is only available in a large jar format as well. And um, this was available before, but years and years ago. So people absolutely loved this scent. And they were really, really excited for it to come back out. I have burnt it both ways. I've burnt it by the wick, good old original way. And I also put it under my candle lamp to see if there was any difference as well. So I've used quite a bit of it. You can see where the wick has burnt at the top and then I stopped and then started using the lamp. Um, it's got the black colored wax on there and only available in the large jar, like I say. On the Yankee Candle website, it's currently $27.99. Um, on some other websites like Temptation Gifts, it is about £23, so it is a little bit cheaper elsewhere. So, the notes for this, we have got uh, woody, sweet, clove, cinnamon with mid notes of jasmine and woody, base notes of patchouli, woody and vanilla. A lot of wood scent in there. So, on an initial smell, not for me. I did not like this. Considering the top notes have clove and cinnamon in it, I thought I would absolutely love this. I never had Witch's Brew when it was out originally. My candle obsession started after that. Um, and it's not been one, I don't know, it's not been one that since I've been collecting and reviewing that's really come up. There's always been new releases and other Halloween scents that I wanted to try. Um, but for me, I was not keen on this on a cold sniff. So through burning it, um, by the wick and through burning it under the candle lamp, I feel like it gives off pretty much the same throw. Um, the, the candle lamp didn't make it throw exceptionally more. So you'd be fine if you're burning this by the wick, but I do still feel like it benefits from being in a smaller room. The throw on this was not very strong, which surprises me because everyone that had the original was saying how strong it was and they were saying how much they absolutely loved this. So. I'd be really interested in knowing if you've had the original release of this and you've tried this one. Let me know down below and everyone else in the comments if you think this one wasn't as good. Because I think the throw rating, I'm going to say maybe 5 or 6 out of 10, depending what size room you're burning it in. I was burning it in like the open plan living room, so obviously it comes through to the kitchen, the dining room. Um, and I would have said maybe more like a 5 out of 10, but I do feel like it performed a little bit better if you was in a smaller room. It just wasn't for me. I didn't get any cinnamon or clove from this at all. The only notes I really could say that I got was the patchouli, the wood sort of smell, maybe a little bit of vanilla and jasmine. But to me, this was quite a musky, I don't know, I didn't like it. It's not one that I would get again and I'm not happy I paid £30 for it basically because obviously I did get it through the Yankee Candle website and obviously it's it's 27 99 and then you've got postage on top of that so it was a no for me I was not impressed um if you would have got some of the clove and the cinnamon coming through I would have really really liked that but for me it was more of a musky the patchouli the woody scents um so yeah not impressed I wouldn't bother getting it again which is really sad because like I say it's the only Halloween scent we were getting here um I have got it up here so some of the ones that um America are getting they've got jack-o-lantern they've got mystic moon and they've got spooky spider cider which I have reviewed that one before and it was absolutely lovely but for me witches brew if you see this jar in this in the store and you smell it on cold that is basically what it smells like when it's burning but yeah very very woody a bit musky for my taste not something that i'd be getting again um i just really would like it if the uk did get more selection for halloween i don't know why we don't and um, there's loads of people asking for it and loads of yankee candle fans that want it um but they just don't ever give it to us. It seems like the UK is forgotten about all the time. So Yankee Candle US are getting those three scents and more, like pumpkin scents. They're also getting a new, um, 
what was it, Bony Bunch collection, the accessories, the sort of cute little skeletons, they're getting that back again. Um, and it's celebrating the 15th anniversary, so there's going to be some new bits in that collection as well. And we just got this. Just witches, bro. And I was not impressed. I would really, really like to know your opinion if you had the original and you've had this to compare. Um, obviously, I haven't got an original jar to compare it to, but... I really wouldn't be rushing to the shops to buy this one, especially not at the price. I just really don't think it warranted it, which for me, I'm really sad. I really wanted a good Halloween candle, but it looks like the US have, have had the better the better share of it for this year. Um, I just hope that one day somebody from Yankee Candle sees all these people from the UK asking for better uk collections um we'd love the bony bunch collection and we'd love all the pumpkin candles and the scented like all the all the different halloween candles you get please just release them over here there's so many people that would buy them um but yeah for me unfortunately six out of ten being generous probably more like a five depending what size room you burn it in so for me which is brew it's a no on this occasion, but let me know what you thought in the comments down below if you've tried it or if you've just had the original. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching and I'll get a new review up for you soon.